Holiday shopping time for so many of you on this Black Friday. Thanks for joining us for some news before you head out the door with the supply chain issues, shipping delays, staffing shortages. Finding toys for your kids could be a little bit more of a challenge this year. And there's a lot of pressure to get your sons and your daughters that special item that they've always wanted. So you might be so desperate you'll just buy whatever you can find. But toy officials are warning to be very careful about this. Joining us right now is Joan Lawrence with the Toy Association, which represents toy manufacturers. Joan, good morning to you. Good morning to you. Thanks Hi. for having me. Oh, we're so happy you're here. So apparently there's this whole market of counterfeit toys that a lot of parents might not be aware of or be aware that there, uh, there's a danger there. I mean, even found on websites like Amazon. So how big of a problem is this right now? It's a big problem. You know, with the increase in, in online sales over the last couple of years, it's increased. But also this year with the shipping delays, we're finding that it's really becoming more of an issue and an opportunity for these unscrupulous sellers to jump in and sell their product to you. So it's not just, you know, I, I've thought about this and the fact that, you know, you're kind of funding this black market by buying these toys, right? But then the other part of this is that when these toys are counterfeit, they haven't gone through the same testing as other toys, like official toys. So, so how dangerous is that? You're right. That is the major concern here because in the U.S., all toys sold here are supposed to have been safety tested and certified as compliant with our tough U.S. standards. And there's over 100 different safety standards and tests. But counterfeit products, we believe, would not have gone through that testing when they're trying to steal somebody else's idea in the first place. So, but how do you spot a counterfeit toy? How do you know before you hit buy that this is not the kind of toy that you want to have your child play with? It, it can be challenging, and it, we really recommend that that consumers do some homework before they hit the buy button. Um, you know, really research the product. Look for places where it's sold. A lot of brands will have their own website and even sell through that website, or they'll have, um, you know, at least provide a list of recognized sellers of their product, where you can find theirs, the original product. And here's a couple of examples of original product. Um, that are both toys. They both comply with our top U.S. safety standards. And um, unfortunately, they're both frequently knocked off online. Um, you can find a lot of counterfeits and knockoffs of these products online. And what we recommend is really scrutinize the listings. So knockoffs of one of these products, um, you know, they look the same. It's a magnetic toy, a magnetic putty invented by this company. Um, it's really quite cool, and it comes with a magnet that is safe and has been safety tested. The product has all the warning labels, all the right safety information on there. Um, and importantly, this product is appropriate for children. Its magnet is not a small part, and that complies with our U.S. safety standards. But the knockoff versions have a magnet that is a very small part and could be ingested by children, and yeah. that would put serious safety issue. Absolutely. Yeah, we, we've heard stories, we've reported on them in, in journalism about how magnets can be deadly uh, for small children. Thank you so much. Uh, we really appreciate you breaking this down for us. A nice warning, especially on a day when people are going to be doing a lot of online shopping. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Absolutely, Joan. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.